Hello everyone, it's the Mats, here to celebrate Festivus 2020. Oh, happy Festivus, everybody. Happy Festivus! Yes. Ho, ho, ho! Uh, I think we probably need to unveil our annual Festivus poll. Yes, so last year I did a little reviewing and saw that our poll was quite tall. I'll give you a little look. Look how high this goes. All the way up into the sky. <laughs> Matt, this is a great poll. It might be the best, best this poll we've ever had. Yes. It makes me want to cry. We'll try to, we'll try not to do it next year. Oh, it was about seven feet tall. <laughs> so very impressive. A majestic poll. Yeah. I'm very excited to see what we've come up with this year. I think this one is very appropriate for this year. All right, let's see it. I, I will be right there. All right, drum roll. The 2020 Festivus poll to be revealed now! <laughs> you may have some. Sure, if you I'll, I'll wait. Come on. Uh, <laughs> I thought he was out. I was concerned. Ah. So you get two. Yep. Two. One for each mitt. <laughs> All right. Whoa. Yes. Geez. <laughs> Things that are getting was, wild up in here. That was not confetti. <laughs> All right, well, now that we've sanitized, Matt, yes. I figured that we'd air our grievances. And given <laughs> that it's a large stack, yeah. I figure we'd do something different because we don't want to take up people's time. Right. All right, so what I thought I'd do, first of all, yes. is tell people what our grievances were last year in okay. 2019. And maybe you can read them, too, along with me. Sure. Uh, so, I honestly don't remember what I grieved yeah, about. Yeah, well, you'd probably be surprised I was. My first grievance in 2019 was the expense of car replacement parts. <laughs> oh, I kind of remember <laughs> that. are up on the top. So my first one was um, plastic packaging, bad for the environment and hard to open. Oh, yeah. yes, like batteries. Batteries. Oh I yeah. I still oh my goodness, that. it's like the worst that thing ever. Stands. Yeah. My second grievance from 2019, the misery makers on social media. I kind of still sticking with that one, yeah. but it doesn't seem all that bad anymore, right? Nothing seems yeah. as bad. For a limited time food offerings. Yeah, I still don't like that either. Okay, okay, fine. Uh, my third. <laughs> well, I don't even know what I was thinking. <laughs> my third grievance last year was wrinkly slacks. Oh. Well, this year everyone's just wearing sweatpants, so. <laughs> so good. Oh, third one definitely still stands. Inconsiderate drivers. Can I go off on this for just go, a second? Go ahead, go ahead. Okay. We got time. Stuck in a jam on 76 a few weeks ago. It was a big accident. Happened like two miles ahead of me. Mm -hmm. And it was in that stretch between Conshohocken and Belmont where there are no exits. So if an accident happens in front of you, you're just stuck because it's like eight miles of oh, no yeah. exits. Oh, yeah. We're sitting there, sitting there, waiting, waiting. People start flying down the shoulder to get around the crowd. That drives me crazy. And it's not the first time I've been in that situation. What are these people thinking? That is crude, rude, and unrefined. It makes me so mad. Yes. Anyway. So, anyway, we thought that we would show you how problems from 2019 definitely do not compare to 2020. And so this is really just a bunch of blank paper. It really isn't grievances at all. What Matt and I decided to do is sort of bring you some hopes, a series of hopes. Would you like to go first, or how do you want to do that? Right, hold on. <laughs> Could you just keep sanitizing? Masks are important. Yeah, I got my mask right here. Yeah. Well, I'll go. I, okay. I look forward. This is very sweet smelling, too. It's, oh, it's, it's nice. delicious. <laughs> Reminds me of Mary Catherine Gallagher. You remember her from <laughs> SNL? She, she did the armpits, <laughs> which I never understood. <laughs> oh, that was kind of weird. A little weird, but... I digress. Funny. Yes. Um, I hope to be able to more easily be active in 2021. Yes. I share that. Because this year, I've been able to be active a little bit, but it's much harder. You know, all the gyms are closed. I used to love my spin classes, and they've had a lot of alterations. And so I'm looking forward to being a little more active, and then hopefully my suits are <laughs> quite as tight. Quick tangent, a friend of mine just bought a Peloton. Yes. He has the best name. You know, everyone has to have a name yeah. when they're doing the spinning. It's 
Leonard Spinner. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah, it, it took him a long time to come up with that. I got three. Okay. Uh, my first hope is the end. I hope the end is near yeah. when I'm talking about the pandemic, obviously. I hope that the vaccine thing is really going to work through the population and people are going to trust it and people are going to still do the measures that protect us in the meantime and the death count gets lower and not as many people get sick. I just hope for the end to be in 2021. I also hope that we find ways to improve our lives by having dealt with this. And I think there's a lot of things going on right now. We can run through a whole list, but I won't. But I hope that this will help us improve our lives for the better. And the final thing is, I hope we up the empathy a little bit more. Yeah. I think that everyone, including myself, could care just a little bit more for others and maybe a lot. Yeah. I was gonna say that too. I hope that we can come out of this and all be a little bit kinder to each other Everybody's under a lot of stress right now, you know, because of everything that's going on. And I think sometimes we have a short fuse as a result mm -hmm. of that. But once things are back to normal, there's no excuse. Hopefully we can all be a little nicer to each other, give each other a little more uh, leeway and mm -hmm. yeah. I don't want to name any names, but when you said short fuse, I thought of Karen Rogers. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking of yeah. She, she's done a lot of nice things during Poor the pandemic. Karen. She, Poor pre Karen. she presented us with coffee and, and, and cookies yeah, and other yeah, things yeah. just last week. Yeah. You just no. give, Karen. You never take. <laughs> and that's a great way to be. That is the way to be. Well, that's your festival. So in 2021, we should all be more like Karen Rogers. We should, yes. Because she herself is so Karen Rogers. <laughs> <laughs> Happy 2020. Yes. Happy 2021. Happy year 2021. I hope you enjoyed this edition of Matt Pelman and Matt O'Donnell Festivus. Yes. And uh, let's hope that our dreams come true. I hope so. <laughs> we'll see what our poll looks like next year. Hopefully it doesn't oh. need the hand sanitizer. Mm. I might hit it. One for the road? One, yeah. It's a long <laughs> drive back home. <laughs> I would give you a high five, but we'll just do air high five. Double? There you go. Bye, everyone. Happy holidays.